bloody rank day in England. So it feels like a good time to leave. One successful beer and pizza hunt later. Some great lift music to accompany. Here we go. Ready. Okay. Perfect. A little bit out of season, but still nice to take a trip. Yeah, I think in a month, being here by the Adriatic Sea would be absolutely delightful. But as of right now, it's not the it's still nice, but it's not quite the baking hot Italian sun. Over there somewhere will be Albania, but not going there for now. I'm in Bari today because I have long been an admirer of the uh, Stadio San... I don't know, is it San Nicola? I've forgotten now, Jesus. Um, which is made for, corporate, um, for Italia 90, like a lot of other um, Serie A Stadia these days and uh, I've got to take a little trip into town do some sightseeing and then we will be off there for Bari versus Benevento Look. 20 euros for a scarf, 25 for a hat. I guarantee I can scalp something outside the stadium for half that. I hope anyway. This water is so blue, it's ridiculous. But delightful at the same time. It's probably too cold to take a dip though. This must be the chillest cat in Bari. Look at that. Clutched on the goddamn van. Guess it's gelato o'clock. There's like a Christian rocket here. Who knew their plan was to go to the moon? So here I am at the Stadio della Vittoria at a Olympic and Athletics ground and also the old home of SSC Bari up until the year 1990 when they uh, finally um, opened the new stadium that they now play in. Uh, as you can see, well, they've put some fences up so I can't really get anywhere near it, which is annoying, but um, it's quite a big ground in itself. Um, Bari being a club that doesn't generally get too much success on the pitch at least. They um, have been in Serie A but not, they're not like consistently there or anything. More than that in a minute. But they, um, you know, it seems like a decent sized ground for their needs. But as you'll see when I get there, um, clearly whoever decided to commission the San Nicola felt different. expensive at all but all the same it's uh, 
such an inconvenience to these poor people. You have to do this every week. Can you imagine that? It's, um, it's a real pain. I mean, you just drive it, wouldn't you? Let's be real. I'm hoping it'll be worth it for one time visit at least. We'll see. One, two, one. What about you? Anyone else? Three one. Lots of goals. Oh, okay. You predict Luigi? Okay. Well, we'll see. Enjoy the game, guys. Ciao. Just met a bunch of drunk Hungarians who are doing the same two games that I am, which is great. Uh, I've got my scarf and I got a beer, so I'm heading to my stand, which I think might be the complete opposite side of the ground, as per the usual for me, especially when my feet are knackered, but here we go. So as you can see, the Stadio San Nicola is absolutely massive. It's meant to be like a flower. So I guess you can sort of see like the gaps between are like petals. It's very interesting, but um, this, is a, this is for a team that's primarily been bouncing between City B and City C. Uh, the second and third tiers in Italy and yeah only I believe San Siro and the Stadio Olimpico in the country are bigger than this stadium so it's a little ridiculous it's nowhere near Bari so um, unless the team are doing well they generally struggle to fill it but I think today um, we've decided going for a back-to-back -back promotion that's right last season this stadium uh, hosted third tier games they won their league and uh, now they're currently third which is not good enough for automatic promotion, but good enough for, uh, for the playoff. And um, yeah, they're, so they're tuned to try and beat Genoa, who they're playing the final day away from home for a chance of getting back into Serie A straight away, which would be a back-to-back -back promotion, as I already mentioned. Or, at the very least, you know, a chance to go in the playoffs, which would be, I think, a, I think a pretty damn good achievement. You see the Benevento bus. Tip whenever going to Italian football, always make use of the food trucks. They are phenomenal. And they got the beer too, eh? A roast pork sandwich to die for. Mamma mia. e inoltre invitato a sedersi sulle scale delle grandi navi. Grazie per la collaborazione. I mean, where else would you be handed a pasta leaflet? In Italy, eh? I'm not the only Englishman here today. David Platt is making an appearance. Played the season here back in the day.
Sanford. in the second half. What's up, Ari?
Gambari take the lead at last. Promotion while well, Benevento stay in relegation trouble. Pretty much gone to form this game, although I don't think Bari were particularly great. It was uh, definitely an interesting match. I'd, um, I'd be very happy to see Bari in this stadium in Serie A next season. What's up, Bari? Benevento down to nine men. Benevento down to nine men. 